हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड यूनिवर्सल असिनक्रोनस रिसीवर ट्रांसमीटर व्हिच इज आल्सो नोन एज यूएआरटी यूएआरटी इज यूज्ड फॉर असिनक्रोनस फॉर्म ऑफ सीरियल डेटा ट्रांसमिशन सो यूएआरटी इज यूज्ड फॉर असिनक्रोनस फॉर्म ऑफ सीरियल डेटा ट्रांसमिशन if we say asynchronous form which means uart does not require a clock signal to synchronize the transmitting end and receiving end for a data transmission so if we say asynchronous form of serial data transmission which means the uart does not require a clock signal to synchronize the transmitting end and receiving end for serial data transmission instead it requires predefined agreement between transmitter and receiver so if we say predefined agreement which means the serial communication settings for both transmitter and receiver should be identical so serial communication settings for both transmitter and receiver should be identical if we say serial communication settings which means it might be baud rate number of bits per byte parity number of start bits and number of stop bit also it defines the flow control so the serial communication settings for both transmitter and receiver should be identical if we take serial communication between a transmitter and receiver in a uart the transmitting bit should consist of start bit then the data and stop bit so serial data that is to be transmitted consist of start bit in between it will be having the data bit that has to be transmitted and also it consist of stop bit here start bit as well as stop bit are special bits in data streams so start bit will be added first and stop bit will be added at the end of the bit stream stop bit is followed by the least significant bit of data and most significant bit of data is followed by the stop bit start bit informs the receiver that a data byte is about to arrive so start bit informs the receiver that data is about to arrive then the receiver starts polling its receive line as per the baud rate setting if baud rate is x bits per second then time slot available for 1 bit will be equal to 1 by x seconds if baud rate is x bits per second then time slot for 1 bit will be equal to 1 by x second so during data communication along with the data bit start bit and stop bit a parity bits will also be added this parity bit will have the value as 1 or 0 depending upon number of ones in the bits that are transmitted parity bit will be having the value as 1 for odd number of ones and parity bit will have value as 0 for even number of ones so uart of receiving device will calculate the parity bit that are received and compares with received parity so uart of receiver device will calculate the parity of bits and compare with the parity to check the error once the data is received the uart of receiver will discard the start bit stop bits and parity from received bit and it will convert serial data to a word if it has received 8 bits so once the data is received by the receiver the uart of receiver will discard the start bit stop bit as well as parity bit then the received bits are converted into word if it has received 8 bits for proper communication the transmission line of sending device should be connected to receiving line of receiving device 
as shown in this figure. So, here Txd represents transmission line and Rxd represent receiver line. So, for proper communication transmission line should be connected to receiving line of a receiver. UART chips are available in the form of semiconductor manufacturing from different manufacturers like national semiconductors 8250 UART chip. So, this chip is considered as standard setting UART and these UARTs are used in original IBM PCs. Nowadays, most of the microcontroller or microprocessor consist of inbuilt UART and they support built in instruction support for serial data transmission and reception. So, National Semiconductor's 8250 UART chip is considered as standard setting UART which is used in original IBM PCs. Nowadays, many microcontroller or processor consist of inbuilt UART which has built in instruction support for serial data transmission and reception. This is about universal asynchronous receiver transmitter which is UART. Hope you have understood the topic. Thank you. <laughs>